Alright guys, so today we got a little bit of a special video here. So for like the first half of this, I'm going to actually be doing uh, like a little bit of a voiceover. I don't know why, but like some my audio for like the first half of, the, of this run didn't record. But uh, whatever, it's all good. So uh, basically, the title doesn't lie here. We're doing a, a true Malawan takedown with no skill points uh, over on the homie, the robot himself. What Wally wishes he could be, Flack the robot, okay? <laughs> So the reason that this is uh, made possible, uh, at least with this setup, is uh, a few is a couple things. One is the uh, fish lap. Two is the knife drain artifact. The knife drain artifact uh, combined with a face puncher uh, is basically going to allow for us to stay alive. Also, the knife drain is going to allow our fish labs to keep us up as well, since we have no way to spec into uh, things like lick the wounds or self repairing system or anything like sort of health regen that flak has or way to get picked back up uh flak has normally we don't have access to with this uh, with this uh, type of challenge so we are forced to res uh, resort to a knife train uh we are using a knife train static charge as well so that's why i'm going to be sliding for a little bit of a extra aoe uh just so that we can get some extra damage chaining to the enemies uh, combining that with groundbreaker since we're doing mostly melee damage we are able to get some extra damage uh, throughout uh, this run as well and you'll see that we are actually holding out a uh, guardian angel for most of it uh, the guardian angel we are holding uh, the anointment on that is going to be the 500 percent uh, elemental uh, dot anointment uh, status effect anointment uh, which is pretty pretty useful uh, to say the least especially uh, whenever we have to go kill wotan uh, which for that setup uh, I would I do talk about it more in the video, but uh, We obviously switched to the unleash the dragon uh, which so we basically sacrifice all of our like health regen and stuff like that to, Just solely uh, for damage capability just so we can down Wotan quick enough now Something I want to note is that like even without having uh, skill points and stuff like that We're still able to put out plenty of damage with things like our fish slap peregrine groundbreaker and stuff like that uh, Easily still making short easy work of things like the kraken uh, In like badasses and situations and stuff like that. Honestly the static charge does help a lot uh, With just getting rid of uh, mobs. Uh, I mean the, those the, the knife train static charge can hit for well over like 200 million sometimes which is very very useful in, in these types of situations uh, when we're really trying to get all like all sorts of like extra damages we can get uh, we are running the basic skag just for five percent overall damage and i will say that the only skill points we have access to are eager to impress and interplanetary stalker from our peregrine Having that one point of eager to impress is very, very useful just so that we can get our racks up a lot quicker. If we didn't have that one point, uh, we would definitely suffer a lot more uh, from rack cooldown. But luckily, we do have that one point, and since we are able to still uh, like you know kill things relatively easily and quick, uh, we're able to get our racks up pretty consistently uh, most of the time. Also, having uh, summoned to interplanetary stalker is going to be very, very useful uh, overall. Uh, just to boost our damage and stuff like that when we are mobbing and then our shield uh, we are going to be using a stinger uh, stinger is just very very good an active skill start stinger as well uh, to provide a little bit of aoe and uh, will be useful whenever we go fight wotan once again but like other than that though there's really not too too much to talk about the setup uh, obviously we're using fish laps but uh, i mean there's only really six pieces like six things that we're working with here uh, I like I don't have anything to modify the racks. We have literally just basic racks with no rack accelerate, no, nothing to send like extra racks. Nothing. We're bare basic. There's only six pieces of gear that allowing us to do all this. Uh, so yeah. Other than that though, I guess I'll let the gameplay play out and then some of the live commentary that picks up uh, in the second half of uh, of this run. But uh, yeah, uh, figure this was a pretty pretty fun challenge to go ahead and try and do. Uh, and yeah, thank y'all so much for watching. Hope y'all enjoy. We'll see y'all on the next one. Yeah, so no cap. I actually pulled out a, uh, I picked up a bitch that had uh, extra rack charge, extra rack attack charge anointment, uh, just so I could like switch, like switch to it and get a extra cooldown of racks, which, you know, is always very useful. Come on, Flack, you gotta be able to parkour over something that is two feet tall, my boy. Trust, trust, trust. Yeah, the bridge will probably be the, uh, the most interesting part to say the least there we go trust trust
Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. There we go. Trust, trust. No. Just got to trust. Go about the business. Trust the fish laps. Trust the fish racks. Trust everything. Do what we got to do. Shoot these, the death spheres, you know, get our life steal up. Make sure that we stay up and about. All good. I can face tank this guy with my face puncher, which is very good, which is very important. Also, I'll switch to the, uh, oh, no, no, no. There we go. There we go. Yeah, honestly, okay. Maybe I should just take off that bitch because it's starting to mess up. It's starting to just mess up my entire flow with my weapon swapping shit. See there, see, see what I'm saying? It's messing up my flow, my mojo, my mojo flow, you know what I'm saying? Just, uh, come on, bro. Yeah, that stinger also really does do be helping a lot. What can I say? I'm taking, I'm taking it off, dude. I'm, I'm unequipped, dropped, just dropped. Just get out of my face, <laughs> okay? Uh, uh, f f fun idea in theory, uh, not so much in practice, by the type thing. Also got to be a little bit greasy on them. Don't want to get tagged on by my own fish lap. Did y'all not hit any enemies? Hello, thank you, appreciate it. There we go, appreciate it. Got that knife drink static charge for mobbing purposes for a reason. Get out of here, appreciate you, Stinger. Look at, see, look at little Skag, bro. It's it, it's just a little Skag, Mr. Chu. Oh, little Skag. All right, let's get rid of these guys. These, uh, these heavyweights, honestly. If I just chain... Should be all good. That just uh, just just be a little bit safe. Throw some of those, some of those slaps. You can hold some of those racks. You can hold some of those those more racks. They're still just staying over in there. I don't know why they're just chilling. I guess it's like their their home. Buddy, does, buddy's petrified. I guess that's what Buddy's doing. Quick, before quick, yeah, there we go. Slide on through before the fish laps gonna get my ass. And now we're gonna go f face the man himself, the man, the myth, the legend, uh, Wotan Schmotan. Now for this, I am actually going to change up a bit of a, uh, a little bit piece of our setup, and uh, going to actually put on a, a dragon artifact. The uh, dragon artifact is going to be very, very key here uh, for this. Uh, for our boss and capabilities. Yes, we do have four in an interplanetary stalker, but that is solely because of our peregrine here. Also, yeah, we do have one and two eager to impress. Uh, a little, that's like the only way we're able to have some upkeep on our racks, but yeah, see, so still got no, so got 70 skill points just chilling to go. All right, well, Tom, my boy, you know what must be done? Kobe! Oh, wow. I guess I uh, wasn't built for it. Now, the this is going to be a little bit of an issue here. Uh, I, I basically have trashed our entire survivability just for damage for this soul situation and purpose. It's that's what we're doing. That's that's what we're doing. Uh, I just literally. There we go. Trust this. Just I just gotta trust my dots, my dragon, and my fish laps, my peregrine, everything, the whole thing, and everything. Just trust, trust, just trust the dot, trust the racks. There we go. Now, if homeboy would like to stop being annoying, just let my racks hit him. Please, just let my racks hit you, buddy. Just let the racks hit you. Yes, sir. There you go. Takedown confirmed. No casualties. My pet. Okay. Mr. Chu did. Oh, I was going to pick him up. But yeah, there you go. Uh, <laughs> yeah, so true Malawan takedown. No skill points. Uh, if y'all want to see the setup, there you go. But yeah, Guardian Angel, Face Puncher, Stinger fish slap unleash the dragon and then our knife train static charge or you could use a knife train white elephant basically your only way of staying alive that is why we use that and then the unleash the dragon solely solely to kill wotan that's you know, that's the sole reason that we had it other than that though guys that is going to just about wrap up the video hope y'all did enjoy it. my name's kree we'll see y'all in the next yo before i outro this video termex i want to see you do this you can do it you can do it if i can do it you can do it all right, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out, everybody.